Hey guys, and welcome back to this blind let's play of Pokemon Crystal! I am still a biting gamer and I am still in Olivine City. Yeah, totally knew that. Um, in the last episode we went up this marvelously tall lighthouse, defeated a bunch of trainers and met whatever the heck name of the Pokemon trainer in this town, uh, or the... It's a, gym leader in this town. I quite don't really remember her name. Um, but we met her and she told us, hey, can you please go to another city to pick up a potion for my sick Pokemon? And we will do exactly that. I'm just gonna have to make sure that the next town... Yes, I think it was Cyanwood City. So that's our plan. Um, I'm gonna double check. Have we healed up our Pokemon? Yes, we have, kind of. Do we have any Pokeballs? Yes, we do. So, I don't see anything else to do than just rock on right now. Uh, wait. Gotta make sure I, we learned a move named Whirlpool. Okay, Psyduck knows how to Whirlpool. Okay, we're done. Let's just ride on Sea Queen out here and... Uh, okay, good to see that walls are back. Uh, hey, swimmer. You have to warm up before going into the water. That's basic, dude. Like, OMG, that's so basic, you have to know it already. Ooh, look at the swimmers having a fancy new anime- or not animation, but, like, drawing. They're still wearing speedos, though. Tentacool! Well, we're gonna body slam a tentacle. No, we have a sea queen now, okay, I forgot. Um... I'm gonna do the usual thing, then. Try to confuse the enemy, and then try to beat it. My specialty. No, oh, it has- Birds above its head. Poor guy. Uh, okay. Flying maybe against water? I don't know. Maybe that's good. That's okay. I'm not really sure. Uh, whoops. Con oh, I hate Constrict. And I guess we don't really... Oh, wait. I thought that was like rap? Yeah, it is, right? We can't do anything now. Oh, okay. Constrict is useless then. Never mind. <laughs> I really thought it was like it would make you get stuck for like forever. Another tentacle, okay. I think we're not gonna go with Super Sonic this time, we're just gonna attack with Peck. Do not poison my Pokemon, please. I hate you, Swimmer Simon. Uh, okay, we need to return to town then and heal up because I wanna train Sea Queen now a bit, so. I don't think we've met a fire-type leader yet of a Pokémon gym, oh, or a ground-type. That would be nice to meet one of those two now soon, so we could abuse some experience points. Uh, <laughs> abuse uh, type advantage to get some more experience points for Sea Queen. I like... I like Sea Queen. So cute. Bum -ba -dum, bum -ba -dum. Okay, Uncle! I give! I never really quite understood where the Uncle thing comes from. In English language, where it's like, Uncle, Uncle, I give up. I don't get it. Well, good thing you were so close to a Pokemon Center. But if that's like any prognosis about how it's going to go uh, on our way to Cyanwood City, then I'm not really that hopeful. We're all gonna die of poison. Yeah, but still, you know. I don't- I like Tentacool and I play with Tentacool. I don't like playing against Tentacool or Tentacruel. That's super annoying. Uh, but whatever. Let's just- have we talked to you, by the way? Yeah, we have. I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I know, I know, I know. Damn it, I know! <laughs> Listen to me, computer. There you go. Uh, I'm still not sure, though, if you actually have to enter those uh, Whirlpool Islands or whatever they were named that we saw on the map. Ooh, a Tentacruel. I don't have you. I only have a Tentacruel. I'm gonna try to capture you, I guess. I like how Tentacruel looks. Oh, don't you dare. Thank you. Please don't continue doing that. But I really like the look of Tentacruel, and I kind of wonder how Tentacruel would taste if you ate it. Would it be like Calamari? Calam- Calam- Calamari? Calamari? I don't know how to pronounce that Italian-wise. Wow, that's so not effective. 
Please hurt yourself and don't use poison sting. Okay. <laughs> Always so nervous. Always. Okay, horn attack was way better. Can you hurt yourself in confusion now? No! Why are you so... Oh, please. Thank you. Okay. This should be enough, right? To capture it with a great ball? I hope so. Crossing our fingers. Come on, everyone. Cross your fingers for me. One. Two. Three. No! <laughs> At least use Constrict, that's fine. I forgot to buy potions, maybe, but... So, well, we have Chiquitita to fall back on, so... We'll just use Sea Queen as far as it goes, or as long as she can, and then we're gonna change to Chiquitita. Damn it! <laughs> Tentacruel! It shouldn't be that hard to capture you. You have, like, no HP left, and you suck. So, come on. I really hated them when once you use the Pokeball, you can't use it again if you fail to capture it. It's like the Pokemon breaks it, I don't know. Tentacruel was caught! I hope it's not gonna be that difficult to capture Pokemon later on. When its 80 feelers absorbs water, it stretches to become like a net to entangle its prey. No, Tentacruel, I'm not gonna use you, but I want to capture you because you're cool. Maybe you can mate with some of my water Pokemon later, I don't know. No inner tube for me! I'm hanging on to sea Pokemon! Sea Pokemon, which one? And I hope you don't use that Pokemon in battle there, Swimmer Paula. I hope you're not hanging on to Staryu, because Staryu is going down! You're going down, down, babe. Ah. Uh, rapid spin! I've never seen that move before. Wasn't very effective now, was it? Nope. Horn attack, on the other hand, was pretty good. Wow, you should never learn rapid spin, apparently. That looked like it sucked. And I guess you have a Starmie. Are you, like, basically a Mystic Lone? No, a Shelder, okay. Shelder! I always like Shelder. They're cute. I wish you could capture a star, you were a star me too. Okay. That looked like he was like serving himself like a platter, you know, when like waiters come and will serve your food and they have this like boom they use. <laughs> That's the best way I can describe what I'm trying to put forward right now. English is hard. But at least the Queen leveled up level 25. Woohoo! <laughs> and we defeated Sumerpola, of course. Ooh, I'm feeling dizzy. While I float like this, the waves carry me along. Further outside into the ocean, I fear I might drown. Ooh, Route 41. Hello. I want to fight you too. The water's warm here. I'm loose and limber. Sure, I'll take you on. I'm loose and limber. <laughs> okay. Good for you, swimmer Charlie. Ooh, I knew a Charlie once. He was weird. Well, at least he has some high-level Pokemon, or higher-level Pokemon than normal. Whoops, I didn't mean to use Peck, but okay. Aw, oh, Shelder knows how to tackle. Can you just picture that? Where he jumps forward and is like, Shelder! Aw, that is cute. Why doesn't Shelder know how to lick? It has a giant tongue. Maybe it does, I don't know. Would make sense if it could. Tentacool. Oh, I don't like you, but we're gonna have to suck it up. Well, once again, I do like Tentacool, I just don't like fighting against it. Oh, critical hit. No. Okay. Weird. Swimmer, Charlie's about to use Tentacruel. Aww. I remember the one in the anime was like 500 feet tall for some reason. I don't really remember why. Maybe it was shiny. I finally learned what shiny Pokemon is. I had heard about it now that I think about it. I had heard about shiny Pokemon. I just didn't realize that Red Gyarados was a shiny Pokemon. <laughs> Stupid. 
Yikes, I've got prune skin. Yeah, you see the stomach there, it's kind of pruney. Isn't it relaxing just floating like this? Yeah, unless you think about all the giant sea monsters that are just waiting to eat you. Okay, I probably skipped like a bunch of trainers right now, but I see the whirlpool hell. Okay, I'm not gonna fight this guy, I'm just gonna run away. We already have a tentacruel. Because, uh... I just see a whirlpool hell- whirlpool here, and... Yeah. I wonder what happens if we just go into it ordinarily. Oh, you removed it, okay. I have no idea where I'm going right now, but that's fine. Sea Queen! La 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 la! Okay, we have to enter land here, apparently. I guess this is the Seafoam Islands. Tentacruel! <laughs> I've only met female tentacruels so far, I think. That's kind of weird. Are there no male tentacles out there? Oh god, yeah, this is probably Seafoam Island then. Let's just go in for just a second and check out what's happening in here. Oh god. I don't have any Pokemon that's not to flash, do I? Electrode can probably learn it though, and I'm not gonna use Electrode, so... I think. Let's see here, HM05 or something, yes. Sai Ai Ai and Chikitita. Chikitita can learn Flash, that's so weird for me. Yes, uh, Electrode can forget self-destruct. I'm never ever in your life going to use self-destruct. That's like the world's most useless weapon ever. Okay, I'm kind of scared. I don't like the music here, you know? It's kind of like, you are going to die. Well, I'm not gonna die by a Subat, but... Uh, I wonder if there's like a legendary Pokemon here, like they're over in like the... Um, islands west of Cinnabar Island in Pokemon Generation 1, Articuno. I wouldn't mind capturing an Articuno, they were cute. I never used it, but I'm probably sure it's good and all, but it always seemed like cheating <laughs> for some reason. Come on, Subat, I want to face some more Ice-type or Water-type Pokemon, like a Jinx or a Seal or something. Or oh, what are one of those, uh... What was the po Pokemon again? I met them some time ago uh, from trainers, like those Swines. Swine, Swin, Swino, Snow, Swinoob? No. Ah, oh, seriously, I can't remember. It was, like, so cute, adorable. It looked like a... Mixed between a hamster and a pig. It was something with swine, swine ob or something. Damn it, I can't remember it. Swine, ah, oh, whatever. Okay, a nugget. That's a good haul. Uh, we're just gonna go around here and check out what we can find. Oh, a crabby. Well, we already have a good water Pokemon in Sea Queen. I'm gonna use Sea Queen for the rest of my game, I guess, but. We can try to capture a Krabby. We can cook it for lunch. Ouch. No, not critical. <laughs> Poor Krabby. Well, we leveled up. Level 26, babe. Uh, okay, we gotta use some... I kind of forgot here that we actually have some stones we can use. And I still don't remember where Kurt is, the guy who wants my balls. Yeah, that came out wrong. But you know what I mean. Okay, we have a super potion that we can use after a while once we get damaged a bit more. Because I have still no idea where I'm actually going here. Okay, or an ultra ball. Well, I'm gonna say that in case there's like a super duper hidden Pokemon here then. Like, oh, you're facing a super rare Krabby. No, but still. Well, we're still gonna try to capture it, though. Please don't critical hit this time. <laughs> I can use Leer, that's so cute. Well, I can use Horn Attack in your eye, buddy. 
Okay, we're gonna use Surf or something now so we're sure that he doesn't die, because it seems like we're taking 33% of his life every single turn, so Surf would probably not kill him since he's like a water poke water type Pokemon too. I was wrong. <laughs> Damn it. Well, still, we're earning some experience points here. 410 experience points is actually not that bad, according to me. I might be totally wrong, but... Another Krabby, I guess. No, it's too bad, damn it. Too bad. Just run away, Sea Queen. You're too pretty to fight a common Zubat. Okay, I have no idea where I'm going right now. And I see that we can't use strength to go down where that boulder is because we can't really push it the right way, so we're not gonna go there. I hate places like this. Ooh, we can surf here. I hate places where I have to think about where to go next. I don't like thinking. <laughs> that sounds so sad, but... Tentacruel, I already have you. I captured your sister earlier. I want a seal. Can't I face a seal, please? Oh, <laughs> I'm a psychic. Look at how adorable that Pokemon is. I want it. Seals are adorable, or dugongs are adorable. Or dugongs are more beautiful. Aww. But I, or whoa! Please don't kill it. Oh, you headbutts me. You could headbutt me anytime. That would be cute. Just like a cat headbutting you. It would just be like, boink. Thank you. Oh, he knows Aurora Beam. Ha. <laughs> that doesn't require a re recharge, does it? So it's just a good move for Ice-type Pokemon. Right? As far as I remember, that's true. It doesn't need to recharge, like... Ultra Beam or whatever it's named. Oh, damn it! No, you can use it whenever. Mm, interesting. I wonder if Sea Queen can learn that. Well, we're just gonna continue here using Great Ball. We're gonna capture it eventually. Enough thing is, like, I feel like I'm growing pretty one sided in my Pokemon I want to use. Like, I've decided, okay, we're not going to use Psyduck after all in my final party of six Pokemon. Only two I have determined so far is basically Side No Sea Queen and Chik Chikitita. And also, I want to use Spinarak because it's pretty cute. But that means we have like one water Pokemon and two grass type Pokemon. And now, if we also use Steel, that'll be two water Pokemon and two grass type Pokemon. But at the same time, I want to use my favorites, you know? The light blue fur that covers it, covers it, keep it protected against the cold. It loves iceberg-filled oceans. Come to Norway then, seal. But thank you for- oops, no, I don't want to go down, I want to find my Pokeball here. Another Ultra Ball. That's nice. But we're gonna use a Super Dupa Potion on... Girly Mac Queen Queen, Sea Queen. <laughs> So, she'll survive a bit longer. Hopefully we'll make it to Cyanwood in this episode, but I can't really promise it. That's... we were up here earlier in the on the top left, so... That's good to know. Bum, 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 bum. Well, I guess I can justify having Seal there, since Seal is technically a water and ice type Pokémon, so that will be like my ice type Pokémon. I don't really know what ice is good against. I used to think that ice was good against, uh, fire, but... That's not the case. It's water that's good against fire. Another Krabby. Hey, I never... I was never able to capture one of those. Okay. Let's actually Super Sonic, you know. I guess not. And the Vice Grip move is actually pretty powerful. I don't like that. Hmm. Stomp! Oh my god. How cute is that? But he's doing a lot of damage. I don't like that. <laughs> you shouldn't do so much damage. We're gonna use a Great Ball. We should survive a bit more. I mean, we should be able to capture him with a Great Ball, too. He's not even evolved. Two. Three. Yes! Crabby was caught! 
If it is unable to find food, it will absorb nutrients by swallowing a mouthful of sand. Krabby, you crazy. Oh wait, I'm sure there's an item here somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Whenever there- you know, there is pretty easy to spot where there are hidden items in this game, just like in Generation 1. I appreciate that. Come on, Calcium. Well, this is Chicky Tita's name written all over it. Chicky Tita, tell me what's wrong. Do you lack calcium in your body? Not anymore. Calcium. Kind of random finding some calcium. Look, Golbat! Where's your tongue, Golbat? <laughs> I miss your generation one sprite. Okay, this can be kind of dangerous, considering... Okay, maybe I'm gonna run away after all. <laughs> I was most, or more thinking about the fact that... Um, he can use Leech Life, which is like super effective against Sea Queen, I think, so... Can't escape! Oh god. Okay, Sea Queen is dead, I think. No. What? Why wasn't that more effective? Okay, let's try to use Horn Attack then. Damn it, you're still confused. Have you noticed that whenever I am confused, I always damage myself in the confusion? While well, the computer never does that. <laughs> Three or four times in a row, I mean, come on. Good going, Sea Queen. Um, you performed... ...averagely. Show them how it's done, Chiquitita. Okay, it was supposed to survive, but never mind, it was a critical hit. Well, that's at least some experience points, even for Chiquitita, so... This is a good place to train, maybe, for me right now. Okay, I hope there's an exit here, yeah. But I'm so confused as to where I am, like, um... Where am I supposed to go? Poor Sequin, she's dead and I'm, like, riding around on her corpse. Cruel. Not sure where to go here now at all. Uh, this is not where I started with the Whirlpool Islands, but I'm so tired of being in there now. There was nothing to gain from going there, so we're not gonna go inside her anymore. We're gonna try to find our way to Cyanwood City. I've always been kind of curious, by the way, how can Chiquitita fight out in the water like this? How can any gra or land type Pokemon fight out here? I don't get it, but whatever. I'm probably thinking or putting too much into it. Like usual. Go Chiquitita! Now I'm gonna try just right on top of those whirlpools. What's gonna happen then? Aww, that's an adorable animation at least. But Psyduck, remove it, please. There you go. Um, I'm still so confused as to where we're supposed to go, but we're just gonna continue on going to the left right now. It seemed to be the the way to Cyanwood City. So we're crossing our fingers for that we're gonna get to Cyanwood City soon. Hello, trainer. Are you seeking the secrets of Rural Islands? Rural Islands, that's the name. That's not Whirlpool Islands, it's Rural Islands. There's a secret there? I haven't seen a secret. Swimmer, Matthew with one T wants to battle. Swimmer Matthew with one T sent out a Krabby. Aww. Can I eat it, please? I have faced higher level Krabbies inside Royal Islands. What are you doing? Well, we're gonna race relief it up. Cut off its uh, pincers. Boom! Shakalaka. And we're level 4. No, we're not. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> we're not level 45 of Shigetita yet. Oh, you got great endurance. Swimmers are really poor. I wonder why. A secret about Royal Islands. It's pitch black inside! Oh, that's not a secret. I just came from Whirlpool I or Whirl Islands. No, Tentacruel, I don't want to capture you. I already have. Or ha I have a higher level Tentacruel than you. And a female one, so she can breed. Because that's somehow important. At night, star you gather near the water surface. Oh, maybe. Oh, okay. It's 5 p.m. right now, so if I wait one hour, maybe I can capture, capture a star you? Swimmer Wendy wants to battle. Set out the star you. No, a hor oh, horsey. I like horsey and Cedra. Cedra the most. 
Look, oops, that was the wrong move. What? Did you just throw a bomb at me? Rude. Rude. Enemy horsey fainted and level up. Finally at level 45. Finally? It's not like we worked so hard for it, but okay. No new Mew moves. Okay. Horsey. And another one. Why do you talk about star use if you don't have any, weirdo? Dragon Rage, really? From Horsey. Well, yeah, I guess Seedra is supposed to be having dragon moves. Well, that's actually a pretty good move for Horsey to use right now, considering I am just so much higher level. That was the correct choice. That was just a bit uh, surprising. Brrrp. Give me some money now, swimmer Wendy, since I defeated you so hardly. Oh, there. The clusters of star you light up the, at the same time. It's so beautiful. It's scary. Well, especially if star you and star me are supposed to be like extraterrestrial. Po oh, yes. We are finally in Zionwood City. We survived. Did you meet the Pokemaniac? He's always bragging about his rare Pokemon. We've met many Pokemaniacs. The Pokemon gym trainers here are macho bullies. If I stick around, they might come after me. Here's some advice. The gym leader uses the fighting type, so you should confound them with psychic type Pokemon. Vipe out his Pokemon before they can use their physical strength. And those boulders in the middle of the gym? If you don't move them correctly, you won't reach the good gym leader. If you get stuck, go outside. I guess this is my advisor then. I love showing off Pokemon that I raced, don't you? I'm going to get into a bunch of battles and show off my Pokemon. Then become a trainer and show off your Pokemon then. I don't, I'm not gonna stop you. But my Chikatita will. <laughs> okay, a fighting type gym. I'm not completely sure what's good against fighting type Pokemon, um, to be honest. Err... Uh, Okay, before we go exploring the town in the last few minutes of this episode, we're gonna go to the computer here. And we're gonna um, deposit Electrode, I think. Or maybe Psyduck? I don't know. Maybe Eradicate? I mean, you did good job, Eradicate. You you saved me a couple of times, but not right now. We're gonna get Seal instead. Hopefully Seal can learn um, Strength. Good, 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 good. Well, Penzer knows how to use Strength, though, but we're not going to have Penzer in our party, so... But I don't think Seal can learn it. No, unfortunately. Uh, no matter. Psyduck can learn Strength. <laughs> Weird. Is there anything else here, Seal, or something can learn that I want Seal to learn? Shadow Ball, Icy Wind they can probably learn, but they can probably learn that naturally. You know, let's just learn Icy Wind to Seal, why not, you know? And then we can take a look at his other moves, too. So you have Tackle, probably. No, Headbutt, Growl, Aurora Beam, and Rest. R r r r growl and Rest are gonna go. I don't like them. We're gonna learn Icy Wind, and we're gonna... Ooh, we... Can't speak today. Okay. <laughs> I don't remember what's good against fighting type Pokemon though, so I'm a bit worried for the next episode where we're gonna face um, the gym leader here. 500 years of tradition, Cyanwood City Pharmacy. We await your medical queries. Queries. I guess this is the pharmacy then. Hey, give me a potion. Your Pokemon appear to be fine. Is something worrying you? The lighthouse Pokemon is in trouble? I got it. This ought to do the trick. Lash received. Secret potion! Lush put the secret potion in capital letters and one word in the key pocket. My secret potion is a tad too strong. I only offer it in an emergency. Well, I guess we've done with that quest then, but we're gonna have to do the gym here too. You crossed the sea to get here? That must have been hard. It would be much easier if you Pokemon you had- I've been saying that all along! But you can't fly without this city. Just gym- If you beat the gym leader here, comes- <gasps> Oh, that would be so nice. I can finally learn how to fly soon. Oh, I would die. Chuck the gym, gym leader sparks with his fighting Pokemon. Oh, Tully the Fisher. Hey, Tully here. What a perfect day for fishing. We should get battle going. I'll be fishing on Route 42. Swing by if you have the time. Well, I'll be seeing you. Bye-bye. 
Okay, Tolly has challenged us. We're gonna learn how to fly and pick him up on that offer. Ah, I am in shock! I got about your age with piercing eyes and long hair came in. He scared me into giving him my prized Pokemon. I still have one left, but what if it comes back? You look strong. Could you look after my Pokemon for a while? Uh, yeah. What a- Oh, it's probably Mary Jo. Are you stealing Pokemon now, Mary Jo? That's kind of rude. Well, he stole the first Pokemon, the... <sighs> hedgehog thing. Uh, okay, we're gonna um, pause it. Psyduck then. Sorry. Sorry, Psyduck. You know I love you, but... I've used you so many times in my life. When you're a mother now, you need to take care of your child. The... Psyshrew. <laughs> I'm in shock. Blah, blah, blah. I wonder what kind of Pokemon this will be. Is it Lapras, maybe? Oh, thank you. Take good care of it, please. Lost your seat up. It never states what kind of Pokemon it is. Hitmonchan or Hit... Shocky? What the hell? <laughs> what is this? Like, seriously. What is this supposed to be? It looks like one of those toys you had as a kid where you could, like, squeeze the ball and, you know, like, Play-Doh would come out of the... Of the holes? What is that? And it was a bug rock Pokemon? Uh, I don't even know what name it's supposed to be. Okay, let's go with the Pokemon we captured and check it out. It's not a Togepi, it's not a no 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 Hoppet, no. That was the ugliest Pokemon I've ever seen in my life, I think. Psyduck. Shuckle! The fluid secreted by its toes carves holes in rock for nesting and can be mixed with berries to make a drink. I don't even know where to start. I mean, if if there's a fluid that is strong enough to carve holes in rocks, then why would you drink it? It's basically acid. Crazy people in the Pokemon world, seriously. You came from Oliwine? Do you remember the four islands along the way? There were four? I heard that a mythical sea creature is hiding in them. I hope you're talking about a seal, because that's the only one I captured. <laughs> or a crabby, too. But I heard that you can only see it if you have the silver wing. It must have the same scent as a creature. What is the silver wing, then? Give me it. I heard that the whirlpools around the islands are caused by the sea creature. You might need a special move to get past them. Girl, since I'm already here, I know how to get past them. If you use Fly, you can get back to Olivine instantly. Yeah, I really want Fly, but I need to see this gym badge first. A port surrounded by rough seas. Boulders to the north of town can be crushed. They may be hiding something. Your Pokémon could use Rock Smash to break them. And I have a Pokémon that knows how to use Rock Smash, I just don't remember which one. Oh, is the Fishing Guru? Oh, I went to Super Rod. Photo Studio. Photo Studio? Really? You have a magnificent Pokémon with you. How about a photo for a souvenir? Oh, okay, it's if I have a, like a... <laughs> the printer thing. Okay, never mind. Not gonna do that then. Oh, and here are those stones again that we can probably crush, but I don't have the move for it. The Pocus here I had, okay. Whoa, what is that thing? I don't want to talk to it, that's scary. I see all. I know all. Certainly, I know of your Pokémon. Okay, what about Chiquitita then? Hmm, I see you met Chiquitita here. New Bark Town. The time was night. Its level was five. Am I good or what? Incidentally, Chiquitita has grown. It's gained much strength. What about my Sea Queen? Hmm, I see you met Sea Queen here. Route 42. The time was night. The level was 20. Am I good or what? Incidentally, it would be wise to raise your Pokémon with a little more care. Oh, shut up, old lady! Uh. Okay, it won't find me. It looks so creepy! It has like ten- Whoa, who are you? Oh, it's, uh... That guy. 
Yo, Lars, wasn't that Suisun just now? I don't only I only got a quick glimpse, but I thought I saw Suisun running on the wide of the waves. Suisun is beautiful and grand, and it races for towns and roads at simply awesome speeds. It's wonderful. I want to see Suisun up close. I've decided I'll battle you as a trainer to earn Suisun's respect. I don't have time for this, you Sulukulut, or whatever your name was. I, I don't want to battle you. Wow, you look kind of fancy. You probably get a lot of magic. Mystical man you sign wants to battle and send out a drowsy. Well, I can also pay, play the psychic game with my awesome sea queen. Horn attack in your face, drowsy. Don't you dare. Really, don't you dare. Boom. This is some way to earn his respect, you Sween. Okay, Electrode. Then we definitely need to change Pokemon here to something that can withstand. Okay, Electrode versus Electrode. He probably is gonna beat me though, but still. Electrode! <laughs> oh, I hate Screech. It's so loud. La 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 la. Well, technically we're- oh god, thunder, oh uh, yeah. But it's not very effect- god, but it still is, just because it's such a powerful attack. Thunder is a really good attack, it really is, but I'm in the lead technically. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be in the lead now, but... Ah, uh, it's gonna be pretty even after this. You screech like one or two more times, please. Don't use thunder. Damn it! Oh, it missed- oh, my electro- One. You just heard a man go from complete happiness to complete despair in a single second. You did a good job, Electrode, you tried, but I guess your best wasn't good enough. And I know, like, Celia's weak against Electrode, but hopefully he can just survive and... Oh, good lord, I was lucky. I'm not even sure how Aurora Beam is going to be effective against him, but hopefully it will take him down, that's all I want, yeah. Good job, Seal, our first battle and you won. I'm proud of you. Hunter, sure, then we can also use Aurora Beam and stuff like that, so... Honda! Girl, my seal is immune to Hypnosis. Okay, that was not very effective. What about Icy Wind? Oh, don't lick my seal, please. That's creepy. Well, we'd use the Nightshade uh, sound, didn't it? La 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 Do not paralyze me. Fuck. I did not swear, I didn't. Just a bit mad. I think my seal is gonna struggle a bit now. Oh, we're not frozen solid yet, so... Do do do, like one or two more attacks, please. We'll be able to do this, I think. Yeah. Ooh, God. Seal is doing pretty well. He won't be paralyzed. He just refuses to be paralyzed. Almost leveled up in your first Pokemon battle. That's my boy, Seal. Or girl. No, boy. I hate to admit it, but you win. Oh, not so much money, though. I wish you had more. You're amazing, Losh. No wonder Pokemon gravitate to you. I get it now. I'm going to keep searching for Suisun. I'm sure we'll see each other again. See you around. Okay, let's go heal up and call this an episode, and we'll continue on the next episode by defeating the gym leader here, hopefully. Uh, I think I've explored everything now, just gonna check the south of this town too, to make absolutely sure. Yeah, here was the pharmacy. Good. Uh, I can't wait to the next episode because we will learn how to fly. <laughs> That'll be the best feeling in the world. I don't have a Pokemon though that I want to learn how to fly yet, like... Probably it will end up being like that Kenya Pokemon I had that I still haven't delivered. Your Pokemon are fully healed. I hope to see you again. Okay, so I have been a fighting gamer. Thank you for joining me on my travels to Cyanwood City. Uh, I hope you enjoyed and see you in the next episode. Toodaloo!